I'm Tina Probin, and I live in Papillion, Nebraska. I have always tried to be healthy and always thought I did a pretty good job of exercise and diet, but in February of 2011, I joined a program that kind of uh, took me off the diet roller coaster. I started a new program and found out that I was eating way too many calories. And once I got the calories and the exercise going hand in hand, I started uh, dropping the pounds and now I'm 65 pounds lighter and I'm in going into my third year of keeping it off, which that is really the key. You can lose weight, but then keeping that healthy lifestyle and keeping it off is a main goal. Every day is a new day. Every day I always exercise, whether it's running or I do the stairs at work or lift weights and I watch my calories every day. I don't, you know, I don't go off the wagon as they say. There's no, no cheesecake and chocolate cake in my future, but honestly, I really don't miss it. I'd much rather feel better and, and feel I look better. My name is Margaret Wynn. The healthy lifestyles that I've made over the last three years were I started slow. I knew that I had a lot of things that I was doing wrong before I started. And so my secret of the first year was eating chili. People laugh at me because I eat chili every day for a year. Red beans are very good for you. They're high fiber, very filling. And that was the secret of my success for that first year. I would say that you just have to get started. Now, I'm really blessed. My husband has always been very, very supportive. I call him my personal trainer. So he's out there exercising with me. We get up at 4.30 in the morning to run. But those are the kind of things that people need to do to incorporate a healthy lifestyle in their busy day. My advice to people who are struggling is take it slow. Don't try to fix everything that's wrong in one day. You're not going to. Always be committed to what you're doing. Do not ever stop once you start. Don't give up. Ask for help when you need it and just keep going.